Welcome back to Infigyan friends. In this video, we are going to take up one very interesting radical equation challenge. Equation is 11th root of square root x plus square root x plus 2 raised to the power 11 plus 11th root of square root x minus square root x plus 2 raised to the power 11 equal to 2. We have to find out real solutions. So let's begin with substitution. The first radical term I will consider A. Similarly, the second radical I will consider B. So this equation becomes A plus B equal to 2. This is our very first equation. Now I will write equation from substitution. So I can write A power 11 and B power 11 from our substitution. A power 11 will be root x plus root of x plus 2 power 11. B power 11 would be root x minus root of x plus 2 power 11. Let's add both the equation. So a power 11 plus b power 11, it would be twice square root x. Let's take the product also. a power 11 times b power 11, it would be a plus b times a minus b, a square minus b square. So I will write root x whole square minus root of x plus 2 power 11 whole square. So square square root will be over. We will cancel it. What is left? x minus x minus 2 power 11. So this value will come out minus 2 raised to the power 11. So ultimate conclusion is first equation a plus b equal to 2. And second equation we can write this one as minus 2 raised to the power whole power 11. And what is left hand side? AB whole power 11. Conclusion is exponent is same, so base must be equal. So second equation which I am getting from here, that is AB equal to minus 2. So two important equations. And we will target this value A power 11 plus B power 11. We will find out a power 11 plus b power 11 and then we will equate that value equal to 2 square root x. Let's solve it. So let me write both the equations first a plus b equal to 2 and second equation was a b equal to minus 2 and our objective is a power 11 plus b power 11 value and then we will equate 2 root x. So let me do squaring, cubing and then we will consider power 4 also. So let me write here squaring and cubing of which equation? This equation a plus b equal to 2. So let us do it. Once I will square this equation I will write a square plus b square plus 2ab equal to 4. Now you can see ab is equal to minus 2. So I can write here a square plus b square minus 2 times 2. So minus 4 equal to 4. So a square plus b square that would be 8. Important equation and important result also. Again I will consider a squaring of this equation. So let's write a squaring of this equation. Consider squaring both sides. So we will have power 4 addition. So a power 4 plus b power 4 plus twice a square b square equal to 64. Now if a b is equal to minus 2 then a square b square will be 4. 4 times 2 is 8. So this value will be 8. So I will take this 8 to the right. So I can conclude a power 4 plus b power 4 is 56. Now let us consider cubing this time. So I will use a plus b whole cube formula. a cube plus b cube plus 3ab in bracket a plus b. So that value will be equal to 2 cube so 8. Let's put the value of ab and a plus b over there. So I will write a cube plus b cube plus 3ab. So minus 6 I will write and a plus b is 2. 
so in next step we can add 8 and 12 so a cube plus b cube is 20 8 plus 12 20 now but our target was a power 11 plus b power 11 so i need a power 9 plus b power 9 then i will multiply with a square plus b square 9 plus 2 is 11 so let's consider cubing once again once i will consider whole cube again so i will write a power 9 plus b power 9 a cube plus b cube plus 3 a b a plus b 3 in place of a b we have to write a cube b cube a plus b a cube plus b cube right hand side is 8000 20 cube is 8000 now i will put the value a power 9 plus b power 9 as it is plus 3 a cube b cube so i will write 3 times minus 8 as a b is minus 2 so a cube b cube will be minus 2 whole cube so that is minus 8 a cube plus b cube is 20 we have calculated here it is equal to 8000 so this is 480 with negative sign once you will take this value to the right then we will be having 8000 plus 480 so 8480 a power 9 plus b power 9 is done 8480 a square value is 8 a square plus b square is 8 so our objective is to find out a power 11 plus b power 11 so let's find out first i will write a power 11 plus b power 11 calculation i will take the product of these two equations a power 9 plus b power 9 with a square plus b square what value we were having a power 9 plus b power 9 this value was we calculated that value was 8480 and a square value was 8 if you will take the product of both the numbers you will have 67840 let's multiply in lhs first let us see what will come out a power 9 times a square a power 11 plus b power 11 plus a 9 b square plus b 9 a square and right hand side is 6 7 8 4 0 now i will take a square b square common so in bracket it is a power 7 plus b power 7 or b power 7 plus a power 7 equal to 67 8 4 0 now let's put the value of a b equal to minus 2 so a square b square will be 4 but important point is a power 7 plus b power 7 from there we will calculate this value we will calculate this value from two equations equation a power 4 plus b power 4 and equation a cube plus b cube if you will check the value of a power 4 which we calculated a power 4 plus b power 4 it was 56 and cube value was 20 so this value will be 56 times 2 so 1120 now left hand side a power 7 which was our requirement plus b power 7 plus a cube b4 plus a4 b cube so we will take a cube b cube common in bracket it would be a plus b right hand side is 1120 let's put the value of a cube b cube so a b is minus 2 a cube b cube will be minus 8 and this is 2 so 1120 plus 16 that would be the value of a power 7 plus b power 7 so let me write here this value will be 1120 plus 16 so this is 1136 so we will apply here 1136 here we will put minus 2 whole square and then we will calculate a power 11 plus b power 11 value let us find 
So I will write a power 11 plus b power 11 plus a square b square. In bracket it is a power 7 plus b power 7. And right hand side was 67,840. Let us put the value of a power 7 and a b whole square. So in this place we can also write 2 root x. So we will write 2 square root x plus minus 2 whole square. This value we calculated 1136 and right hand side was 67840. So I will write 2 square root x plus 4 times 1136 equal to 67840. Once you will take the product then you will be having 2 square root x plus 4544 equal to 67840. 2 root x will become you will write 60840 minus 4554. So this value will come out 33920 minus 2272. What I did? I divided both sides with 2 as numbers were divisible by 2. So root x is equal to 33920 minus 2272. So I will write here square root x will be equal to this value was 31648. So once I will take squaring both sides it will become 36648 whole square. This is our answer and if you want to expand it we can write this value also. This value is 10015959 and 04. You can cross examine here. This value is if you will put over there then this value is coming out 2.73205 dot 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 and second value this value is coming out minus 0 0.73205 dot 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 you will take away value you will be having 2 which is our RHS.